Hey guys, Zentis here. I'm going to tack this on in the beginning of the video, so it's something that's going to be a bit weird. But it's currently Friday morning. I'm just about to leave. I've decided I'm going to leave my computer here as uh, and not record over the weekend while I'm at home. Just because of the fact that, you know, in this game, there's so much fun stuff in it. But playing it for so long, you know, you kind of just want to like take a break from it. So I'm thinking for this upcoming week, we are going to be taking a break from playing Subnautica. Uh... The following week, it is going to continue up again. Uh, basically, I'm going to use this week to, uh, you know, like, focus on my channel, like, make some channel art, you know, while I'm at home uh, for the new series that I'm going to be coming out with for Subnautica. And if you guys do enjoy uh, what happens, thank you. If y'all unsubscribe, I do understand, but I just want to tell, I want to be forthcoming with you, but there will be more Subnautica to come. Uh, I have huge plans, uh, I have huge things I want to do, which is why I'm facing out this window, just watching the particles, because, uh, some stuff has happened behind me, and I just don't want to spoil that, so, I'll see you guys all in a week, uh, thank you all for watching and becoming part of, like, this little YouTube family of mine, it's been such a great honor, and such, like, a great experience that I would not give it up for the world, so, Thank you all, and I will see you all very, very soon, guys. Hello, everyone. Later. Happy Friday. What the lag? Um. Hello, everyone. Happy Friday. What the lag just happened? I don't know if you heard that, but somehow, like, my, um, my mouse got off Subnautica, even though it's, like, pretty much full screen. It shouldn't be able to. I have it windowed mode just so I can easily transition between, you know, recordings. Uh, I'm going to give you just a warning. This is a warning, not... A definitive there may not be any videos coming next week for Subnautica uh, I am having a guest stay over with me all next week uh, they've never been to the DC metropolitan area I am going to try to pre-record a lot but if I don't get five I just I mean maybe if I just I don't know I'll try pre-recording as much as I can. I'm actually leaving tomorrow. This video is the last one I wanted to put up. Be, I mean, this one's the last one I wanted to record because I wanted to, like, I did a lot of Subnautica the past two days, you know, for recording um, to get everything up and going. So I wanted to, like, take a break from Subnautica, you know, and go out and just do other things. But now we're here. Like, Subnautica is here. We just need to get it done. So uh, if I can get all five, it'll be great. If I can't, I'm terribly, terribly sorry. Uh, I will upload what I can on the days that I can, and just know that when I get back, probably like Saturday and Sunday, I'll just uh, upload the rest for you guys. Uh, we're, what we're going to do today is try getting three more bits of stalker teeth, just so we can get our five enameled glass, because we'll get out in a second near the um, kelp forest biome. And you'll see that, oh hey, we, uh, yeah, we only have a certain amount of stalker teeth and we need way more. So, with that being said, I'm about to pop on out of here. Oop, hello. I don't want to go anywhere near you. Let's just go over here. But if I do manage to do them, like next week's videos, guys, I'm going to just, they're probably going to be 20 minutes. Like if I do, like, record them. I'm still up in the air if I'm even going to. Just because there is a lot of stuff I need to get done before I can leave here. Uh, and, quite frankly, I don't think it's, like, fair, you know, to upload, like, lousy quality when it's just, like, me rushing to get it done. I know I've done it before, but, like, I'm trying to make changes to the channel. I am trying to pre-record a lot of other things, too. And so, yeah, let's just, uh, gotta find some t stalkers around here. I uh, really need those teeth. That's mainly the goal today is just to look for the stalker teeth. Um, yeah. I wanted to just say thank you all, though, for watching, being good patrons. Uh, it does not mean that Subnautica is coming to an end. It just means that, you know, I'll be busy. And then when I come back, you know, I, you'll uh, definitely have way more Subnautica. Hopefully even, guys, there... There. Hopefully, guys, maybe there'll be an update while... I'm away. Uh, that would be beyond fantastic if I come back and it's like, oh hey, uh, you were gone so long, so we decided to update for you. 
Like, I'd be happy about that. Have we gone in this one this time? I really can never tell in Subnautica, like, have, if we've been somewhere or not, because, you know, we do, like, do a lot of repeats, but... Just go down in here. I know that they have, like, some caves in, uh, this here biome. So it's kind of nice that we're actually like, seeing one. The drooping stingers. Zentis right now has uh, decided to lick my uncle. I don't know why. My gold. Well, let's just check out inside here, have we? Been in here this time? We haven't because we need the laser cutter. And I don't have a laser cutter. And I'm not going back for one. But... By George, we have found a stalker. For a second, I thought there was a stalker tooth right below us. I would have been super duper happy. Okay, hit us. Any stalker teeth follow? Why don't you drop a stalker tooth? Did that make you drop a tooth? Well, shock teeth out of you. Come on, find me some teeth, guys. By guys, I mean the stalkers, not y'all. I mean, if y'all could find the teeth, that'd be really great. Unfortunately, there's no way of telling me what it, where they are, which kind of sucks. Um, where, oh, where are stalker teeth? Like, where, oh, where could they be? But to get stalker teeth, we need stalkers. And the stalk only stalkers we've been able to find were over here. So maybe it's just a waiting game, you know? Just watching them attack some stuff. We could work on the terraformer and make a little stalker room. Hello. Oh, we hit a boomerang and, I mean, a hoverfish and killed it. You know what, let's try that. Let's go back to the compound. Uh, we'll hatch a couple of stalkers. And then from there, we'll just keep on hatching stalkers and we'll put them away. You know, like, we'll just make sure we always have about two. So I need, I need to have, like, a hatchery. Just for, you know, like, oh, hey, we have this thing here. That would be kind of fun. That'll be what we work on today. We'll be working on making uh, our original base into like a hatchery type of ordeal, I think. Just because we can. Um, I think that'll work. Not entirely sure, though. Let's go look inside of it. We'll tear down the one bad boy that we have up in there. And we'll make another. What am I getting? Okay. Welcome aboard, Captain. Yeah, we have to tear that down. So where is our... We don't have it. It's probably up here in one of our chests. Unfortunately. <sighs> Such is life. We could turn the... down there into a hatchery. That'd be kind of cool. Like, I don't actually know how that would work with the... plant on it. Or even up here into a hatchery. Like these two. Yeah, those two, I think, are going to be our hatcheries. I like that idea a lot. So without further ado, let us grab... Oh, you got... Oh, it was in our inventory the entire time. Four. Alright. Now we just need... Alien containment. That's what it's called now? Okay. All right, we're going to need to put the, all that stuff in there once we have all the glass. And how much inventory space we have? We have definitely enough for the glass. That is for down sure. Wait. Do we have already? Let me just check. Did we manage to get you up to Mach 3? Oh, yeah, we have. All right, let's just go get 8 bits of quartz. 
Um, actually, let's try getting as many cores as we can now that I think about it because we're going to need more glass for the, um, for the hatch that's going to be on there. But that'll be all we do in this episode, guys. It's going to be a short one because, like I said, I'm going to try getting enough done to last, you know, um, six days worth of episodes. And I'd rather get the six episodes out because I love playing this game. Don't you guys worry that it's only like this week and then I already know that I'm going to be going away early. So that's why I'm thinking I'm not actually going to put out the work that I want to put out next week. Like the new series, I'm going to hold off on it, in fact, and then wait. All right, how much do I actually have? Four, six, so that's three. So if we can get a little bit more by way of cords, that'd be really nice. The sparse reef is super cool. How much room do I have? One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Get inside me. Night time approaches. Okay. Got some quartz here. Got some quartz here. And there. Always good stuff, the quartz, you know? And this will be all the quartz that I think I need to make the glass in order to make the um, first one. After that, you know, we'll definitely, I'll focus on getting, you know, the, all that I need to make the second one. Uh, and that'll be off camera. This is just a temporary spot, I'm actually thinking. I don't think I actually want to make this into a uh, hatchery. Although I could. It wouldn't hurt to make the top floors of the fir of this middle bit into a hatchery. The bottom floor will be, you know, more of a um a lounge area maybe or like more storage based. I guess, but this top floor as a hatchery, that actually doesn't look half bad. Do not Okay, I was like, do not run into the base, please. Basic all the glass we can handle. Glass. And can I point out that I have plastic in my um, inventory that I don't think I should? Like, I don't know how it got here. I really don't. Let's just see. Is that plastic lingot? Okay. I thought I used up all my plastic lingots. This is a little strange to me. And then we're going to put our hatch on this side. And we'll just hop on in. Alright, we'll just place two of those bad boys down. That doesn't appear half bad. Okay. Uh, we may even make a... Um, Make two storage lockers. Not st I mean just regular lockers here or no. Here's not. Here's it'll only allow for one. Alright, well. We need another glass. I think only having one locker, one thing right there, but can we actually place a wall locker here? And a wall locker. Oh, hey. And locker, locker. I know I'm like super focused mode now, you guys, but right, let's definitely do that. Let's definitely do that. Let's definitely do that. And now let's try centering it again. Oh, 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 oh. This is like super hard placement. I wish that they made this a little bit easier. Oh, come on. Oh, I can't have it centered right there? Weird. Oh, well, that'll be where I store my, um... So we need four bits of quartz. 
four more bits of quartz and that'll be all set. Let's go grab four bits of quartz, shall we? Welcome aboard, I say we take it a bit deeper this time to grab the quartz. Uh, let's go down toward the Sea Treader path again, shall we? I love that. I love our location, guys. I love how we're doing in the game so far. Uh, it really seems like you know we're we're making advancements, and once we have these, you know, it's just going to be that's just egg storage. Uh, I want to have at least two types of eggs at all times in there so that's gonna be our first order of business is just getting two types of eggs uh, followed by which we're gonna go back and hatch all said types of eggs and we're gonna have you know two types of creatures a two type of creature storage on the opposite side just for the sake of hello oh, quartz just for the sake of you know always having excess creature just in case we need them um, what I am going to need is a way of getting reef back eggs. Uh, I don't know if they're still in the game. I don't know if I'm even going to want reef backs out near my base, but like, say down here. I'm thinking I am going to put like some like jelly rays, like a lot of jelly rays, like around like down here and make another base. Okay, we found it. I need to go down here to take a picture, you guys. Like, this area just seems so freaking fantastic. You just get out. Uh, that was terrifying. Uh, zero. Let me get in. And let me three. This place is so awesome looking. Like, I may even turn this into, like, another base. Like, this may be, like, a cool little outpost type base, you know, like where we have a lot of fun stuff going on. Like seriously, look at this crab. Okay, we're not. Crab doesn't want to look at us right now. This area is so massive. And like it just seems to get bigger too, that's what I love. Oh, hello. Okay. But, like, seriously, guys. Imagine me building a base down here. Maybe next season, you know? Like, we're at a depth of 500, so maybe next season we'll just focus on getting... Oh, where are we now? Oh, bugger! What on earth is that? Oh, my gosh! Hi. Hi. Busy checking you out. Guys, I don't think we want to live down here. This for sure is the inactive lava zone. No, it's the ILZ corridor again. Uh, this is an incomplete biome as we found out last time, you guys, but... Let's just go exploring, shall we? We have 82% battery. Uh definitely want to like start working out down here not like working out working out but y'all know what I mean um I'm a little terrified to tell you the truth things have in this series have been spawn huh like that they just start spawning in on us like out of nowhere uh, man like I know what's supposed to live down here I'm excited for what's supposed to live down here. This is end game content of the Sea Dragon Leviathan living in his house. Of which I am terrified of right now. We're probably even getting close to where the butt cloaca of the world lives. Or is, I should say, rather. Oh my lord, you guys, load in. Look at this place. Look at that little hole up there. Oh, we get definitely an incomplete area. Ah! 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 It got red! It got red! I don't like red. Let's make our way out of here before I get dangerously lost. We also can only be down here up to 900 meters. Oh, man. Oh, man. That scared me. 
I see red. I literally saw red. You all saw red. Oh, man. Yeah, we're just going to go ahead out of here. We're going to grab our quartz. That'll be an episode. Uh, That's most definitely basalt. I like that they have just one random patch just spawning down here. This area is going to be beyond cool when it's all said and done. Only problem is, with it being so freaking close to where we are, guys, I don't know if we're going to be able to keep the world. Like, look at this. That's literally, like, here are the balls for the world. And yeah, look, we're pretty much under the compound now. Oh, my word. And here I thought we were safe where the compound was. But I was wrong. We're at 67% health, too. That crab squid did a real number on us. This area is beyond cool. Oh, man. Yeah, so this is the inactive lava zone corridor. Hence ILZ, for anyone wondering. I mean, that red area that we were in before was probably the inactive lava zone. But all the more reason for us to want to live here, right, guys? You know what? Stupid crab squid. Hey. Hey, buddy. Yeah, you. I'm watching you. Come on. You. Get wrecked. Hate you. Love you, actually, but... Hate you at the same time. Alright, we gotta find our way out of this little tunnel thing. Oh, uh, that actually took up a lot of freaking energy to use that EMP. Oh, nope, not here. Not here. Not here. Go down. Swim down. Are we just trapped in here forever? I wouldn't mind. Sort of. No, we found our way out. Beautiful. I may actually seal this off, you know? Like, with uh, some stuff. Like, what do they call Platforms up there? And then just be able to... And use, like, the Terraformer or something? That'd be really cool. Alright, let's just get our Quartz on. Shall we? We just need Quartz. That shouldn't be too hard to find down here. Unless quartz just doesn't exist down here. Uh, we're a smoking fool. I'll just get out. Tabby tabby. Five a five it. Five a five it. Alright, come on. Get a fixed job going, why don't you? We're actually getting really thirsty now for some reason. I all noticed that we've been getting thirstier and thirstier lately. Ow. Spade fish hurt us a lot. Oh, found another wreck. However, I am almost 100% positive that we're not going to be finding quartz, so I am just going to go back to compound and call this an episode, you guys. I'll find the quartz off Camry. I'll make this stuff up, and then I'll come back probably a little bit later. I'm going to render this one up now. I'm going to render them as I go, so that way... Mild dehydration detected. Fluid intake recommended. Yeah, thank you. So that way I know I'm getting them up. Uh, technically, you know, I'm only busy until next Thursday, Friday maybe. It all depends on if I bring my computer with me when I go home this weekend, because if it's if I do, it'll be only till Thursday. And if I do, I'll have an extra day to record, which is my only reasoning for wanting to. But at the same time, it's just like, eh, why? So we'll see how it goes, guys. We will see. I may, in fact, do that, though, just because it'll just be easier on us. That being said, though, I'm your host, uh, Zentus. If you guys enjoyed the video, do press that like button. Subscribe for more content. As always, I will see you all in the next video. Hopefully some awesome things will happen in that one. And, boosh!